what's up everybody it's mike the quad here we're going to show you how to install three vsts that i feel are necessary to making your audio sound so much better okay we're over here we are going to open up wavelink now in order to install the three vsts that we're going to go ahead and show you here is the button for the elgato marketplace okay once you have the elgato marketplace opened up Go to the search bar, type in equalizer. And you're gonna go ahead and add this. And here it's gonna say instead of open in Wavelink, it's gonna say add to cart. And these are completely free. The next thing that you're going to get is the noise removal. The one that I'm using is the noise removal that is the ultra lightweight version. There are two versions, ones that uses your GPU hardware. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and just use this one. Okay, and the next one that we're going to be getting is compressor. This one just came out, and this will help compress your audio. After you do that, you go to your cart, and even though mine is empty, it's going to have those three up there, and you're going to go ahead and check out. And they are all free. Okay. Now, once you have all of those installed, you're going to go over here to this little wave icon where your microphone is at, and you're going to click it. Now, I already have the audio effects installed right here, but in order to have them shown right here, I'm going to go ahead and remove them all. And what you want to do is use the plus sign that is right here. Go to the one that says Elgato, and then you start adding them all. Once you first add the compressor, this is what it's gonna look like. You can go ahead and do this. This is a little easy tutorial. Vocal compression is a secret to sounding pro. Let's do this. All right, and then now what you have is a little slider which can go right at to the peaks. And then we're gonna click finalize. So now your output is gonna be compressed over here. And then it shows you that it's actually cutting off at the peaks so you aren't sounding too loud on your microphone. Okay, now the next thing that we're going to install is the noise removal. Now noise removal is pretty easy to use, especially with this one. Once you click it and install it, it'll actually have it on. But I just wanna show you, this is what it sounds like with it off. So that was me tapping on my desk. But now we have it on. See, and it shows that it uses AI to go ahead and remove any noise that is not your voice. Now, the last one that we're going to use is the EQ. Now, the EQ right here is going to show your voice and what it sounds like on the microphone. And if these sliders right here, this right here will actually cut off the sound from this part and then also cut off from over here so it gives you a certain range. Now you have one single slider right here that shows what that's for, but in order to add more little sliders to better define your voice, you just double click in any of these areas. And as you can see, it has this. And if you want to figure out each area that is highlighted in the gray and the white, you can go ahead and click this little icon over here and it'll show you what you are actually moving. Go down here. All right, now this is what I usually have for my voice, so it probably sounds a lot different. And there you have it. You have enhanced your audio and made your voice sound a lot better. Hey everyone, thanks again for watching the video. If you have any other questions or comments, please leave them below and we'll have more tutorials on how to make your setup even better by using Elgato products. Have a good one.